Welcome to the Judge John Minor Wisdom Courthouse, located at 600 Camp Street, across from Lafayette Square. The building was completed in 1914 and has served as the court's home since that time, with the exception of a 10-year period from 1963 to 1973. The court returned to the building after it was renovated in 1973 and has been there since then. The clerk's office is across the street in the Bear building, which is located at 600 South Maystreet Street in New Orleans. The courthouse itself opens at 8 o'clock. Check-in for oral argument is up till 8.30. Please get here on time. When you go through security, you will need your ID. You will also have to take off your belt. You'll also have to put anything else through the usual security routine. And your phone will be put off. Your phone will stay off until you exit the building. Hi, welcome to the Fifth Circuit. Thank you. Good Which morning. case are you here for? Jones versus Jones. Okay, are you Mr. Richard? Yes, ma'am, I am. All right, I have you down as the appellant. Um, for you and that's great. Um, you'll be in the East Courtroom, which is on the second floor, room 223. Take the elevators up, take a right, it's at the very end of the hallway. Um, I have you down, Mr. Richard, as the appellant. 15 that's minutes good. to open and five for rebuttal. That's, that's and good. And you can proceed to the courtroom. Thank you very Thank much. You so much. Thank you. United States Court of Appeals for the Fifth Circuit is now open according to law. God save the United States in this honorable court. The first case on this morning's docket is Jones versus Jones. Mr. Richard? May it please the court, my name is Don Richard and I represent the appellant in this case. Counsel is now at the podium prepared to deliver his oral argument. It's important to stand tall, speak loudly, clearly, and slowly. There are several things on the podium to guide your way. There's both a lighting system and a timing system. While the green light is on, you go. You proceed forward with your argument. But when the amber light in the center comes on, that signals that you have two minutes left prior to the end of your argument. And when the red light comes on, it is an absolute stop, even mid-sentence. Your argument is over and you may not continue unless the judges invite you to do so. You'll notice that simultaneously, a clock is ticking backwards, telling you how much time you have left to deliver your argument. One final note, if you are the appellant and also delivering a rebuttal argument, the lights will go straight from green to red and you will not get a two minute amber warning. At the conclusion of your argument, you may choose to stay and listen to subsequent arguments, or you may choose to leave if you like. We do ask, however, that if you choose to leave at that time while court is still proceeding, please do so quietly. You'll notice that both the entry gate and the doors to the courtroom itself are very large and can swing very loudly, so please use care to, to close them softly. In addition, once in the hallway, please do not hold a conference with your clients or co-counsel to discuss the case. The judges and the other occupants in the courtroom can still hear you, so you'd be wise to either proceed to one of the attorney lounges or to the Fifth Circuit Bar Association office. If your case is not the first one to be called, you may wait in an attorney lounge. There are three identical attorney lounges, one next to each courtroom. You'll notice a numbering system in the lounge itself that tells you which case is presently being argued. When that case moves into the rebuttal phase, that is when the number will flip to the next case number. It's very important, however, not to rely exclusively on this numbering system as sometimes cases settle or are not argued for another reason. You may have to present your argument sooner than you expected. 